we're back with our trusty laptop again and something that I was struggling to find out when we when I was first uploading shorts to YouTube was actually how do I do it from a laptop or from a computer or stuff like that it's easy to do it on your phones you literally I think it's like the plus button isn't it I mean I don't upload videos from my phone so it's not something I do all the time but if you go on the plus at the bottom if you can upload a video or create a short and that's a little bit like TikTok and stuff like that where you create your TikToks like that it's the same way you can do that with your shorts on YouTube but I didn't want to have to create it on my camera edit on my laptop put it on my phone and I could not figure it out for the life of me how do I put it onto the laptop straight away so i thought i would come on and i would just quickly show you and not just show you how to upload it show you what it is that i would do if i was creating a video but i actually wanted to get paid for it as well so i'll show you that as well it's actually really simple and really easy when i tell you this you are probably going to kick yourself and to be honest i didn't think that this would actually be the case but all you do is you're obviously on your dashboard and what you do is you literally hit create upload videos and you do it exactly like normal and then what you'll do is you'll get your ordinary way of uploading where you've got to do your title your description um, your tags and stuff like that all of that is exactly the same but when you look to the right you can see the layout of the video is correct so you'll have like your portrait video and then it'll be like zoomed in in the background and that's obviously exactly how we want it and something that I have heard I don't know if this is something that needs to be happening I don't think so it might just help with the algorithm a little bit better is when you are uploading like shorts and stuff like that in the title you want to I don't know if you have to put a hashtag or not but I do I just put hashtag short I'll do it in the description I'll put hashtag short and I will also put it in the tags as well and just it means it cannot get lost at all and it means that YouTube definitely knows that this is a short and it will put it in the right sort of place now I believe that as long as your video is under a minute I believe that's when it will then put it into the shorts place and you have to remember it's not only going to show in the shorts it does normally show in your ordinary page but it does list it a little bit differently so I guess it's not the end of the world but as of right now I know YouTube's wanting them a less less than a minute so I think as long as you put up any video that is less than a minute it will come up listed as a short video I know there was this big conversation that if you want to create money on YouTube you need to make a video that is over eight minutes that I guess is still the case because you can't have multiple adverts within your video however I've also found if you're creating videos the same way you create if you're creating shorts the same way you create tiktoks you will not get monetized for that because you are using audio that isn't yours to use you need to find the no copyright music to use on your youtube channel no matter what and it's a little bit annoying at the fact that you have to sort like you can't use that option and you won't get paid it just comes up that you, you, it will not monetize you so in order to get around that obviously the best way to do it is you will edit your video like normal on the laptop you'll have your own music and stuff like that but on my other channel that's not the same sort of way that I would do it I do like to have music it's more like a time lapse that I would do on that on that channel so that's something that you like to do and you would like to pick some music and stuff like that a way that I get around it and if I can't add the music when I'm editing the video if I can't do that something that I will do I probably won't be able to show you right now unfortunately but you'll sort of get the idea so what I will do is I'll upload the short with no sound on at all because I've found that if you do have the sound on it doesn't work it just doesn't let you do it so I'll go into one of my other videos and I'll show you but I don't think it'll work because there is sound there you go into your other videos you'll go onto the like to edit it so details and if you go into editor 
you'll probably have to wait until it's uploaded but shorts takes literally a second so i wouldn't worry about that so you'll go once it's uploaded and stuff like that and you've done everything you need to do go into editor and you can edit your video from here it might actually let me do it might have just been a coincidence the last time but where the audio is if you click on plus you can use any of youtube's audio and you just need to if you click on these three lines you can just put attribution not required or you can do the attribution whichever one you prefer and then you can click any one of these videos and you can use any one of them and that video can then be monetized because you are using the music that youtube gives you not the music that's on youtube does that make sense because it's all like your viral hits and stuff like that that is on the create a short part you don't want to do that um but if you want to get paid for it do it this way and it will work but yeah i think that is basically it when you are creating your shorts one thing i'm struggling with at the moment if you know how to do this is if you see here you can see that i have got a thumbnail on my video but if i search that thumbnail's not there it just gives a random rubbish thumbnail that i don't want it to have <laughs> so it's really frustrating so if you know how i can get around that it because it, it doesn't let you upload a portrait photo which is ideally what i would want it doesn't let you do that maybe i need to do it from my phone rather than the laptop so i'll update you on that as of right now i don't know about the thumbnail so obviously i'll create a thumbnail like normal but i'll try and do it so that the portrait bits in the middle so that if it was to crop stuff you know it would just sort of get rid of the bit around the outside that i don't necessarily care about but that doesn't work either and you'll get these rubbish thumbnails and i don't feel like that helps at all to get people's attention so there's that but yeah um if you know how to get a real thumbnail on the video i would absolutely love that and apart from that i hope this video helped and show you how actually easy and simple it is to just upload from your laptop it's a lot easier than what you would think and i hope this helped subscribe if you are wanting to see more from me let me know in the comments what more you want to see from me and yeah thank you so much for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one